when I was doing stand-up originally, I mean, Kinnison was the guy. Right. Yeah. And so, you know, when I'm in a club and then Kinnison's on, I just think, I should stop being a comedian. <laughs> right. It's like it, it, it can actually defeat you to see somebody great at their craft. When yeah. you're, you know, I sometimes would look at Kinnison and go, oh, my God, this guy's light years ahead of anyone. How does anybody ever go into stand-up comedy when there's Kinnison? Yeah. I think about him every day. One of the most brilliant comics, comic minds, and everything. I, I used to see him when the crowd didn't know who he was. Right. And that was a whole different thing. Right. Uh, we did a comic relief uh, benefit in uh, 86, and, and no one really knew who Kinnison was yet. Maybe he had been on HBO a little bit. But at this uh, charity event, he comes on and does the greatest hits of Kinnison. Right. And then he tears the roof off the place. And it had a bit hard for you to see, it was for me, to see a great comedy mind like that. And I knew Sam pretty well. To see him destroy himself the way he did, because I saw him go out many nights when yeah. he was drunk, and it really killed me. I go, oh, to have those kind of gifts and to, and to just abuse yourself. The abuse is crazy, right? I mean, yeah. it just doesn't make sense. Well, yeah, especially when it's in slow motion, mm. when when somebody is uh, struggling, and everyone knows he's struggling, and everyone's trying to help, and you realize, oh, at some point. Uh, people have to f figure out how to do it but i think he was sober at the end of his at life the end, yeah. yeah he was uh, which is really the tragedy of it which is he really got it together yeah uh, but but what's weird about comedy now i don't know if you think this is the case there really aren't any wild men anymore no there's no in, like insane people in mm -hmm. comedy everyone's really good and i think comedians are probably better for the most part but where are the lunatics? Maybe the comedians are better at covering their insanity, but they yeah. t but it's, insanity should be embraced. Like Andy Kaufman seemed insane. Yes. I don't know if he was or wasn't, but he seemed insane. Uh, Kinnison seemed insane. Dice seemed insane. Yeah. Everyone seemed, Bob Goldthwaite seemed crazy. Yeah. Uh, even I remember the first time I saw Howie Mandel on the Merv Griffin show, I thought he was mentally ill. Yeah. I mean, it was, it was, it was great with the crazy guys. Yeah. Right. And that's, uh, it's sort of everyone wants to be now the snarky Harvard type guy. I and guess. the one thing about Kinnison, was I saw him one night just come on and do all new material. He was just riffing off the top yeah. of his head, yeah, he and he was mind. great.